Hi, my name is Hannah Georgia Hussell, and I'm from Legacy of Purpose Preparatory Academy. And my math fair project is pool table math. So we're going to talk about the pool table shapes. So the balls are spheres. And the whole pool table is a rectangle. And there is also a rectangle over here. The pockets are a circle. And the rack is a triangle around the ball. And these pool table sticks, the pool table sticks are lines. This is a half of a, of a rectangle. It's two squares. And the net has diamonds. Now I'm going to show you angles and lines, the right angle. The right angle looks just like an L. The right angle is the same as 90 degree angle. Now we have the acute angle. I'm going to show you a trick. So, yeah. A right angle. Yeah. Bisect. And then we're going to take this one away. And that, an acute angle is less than 90 degree angle. Now I'm going to show you that, now I'm going to show you that obtuse angle. So we have the right here. Now I'm going to show you, now this the obtuse angle is more than 90 degree angle. Now I'm going to show you the bisector angle. So we have this right here. Now I'm going to go to line. We're going to do intersecting lines. This is an intersecting line. And then we have perpendicular lines. And then we have parallel lines. show the different triangles. So we're going to do the Assassin's Triangle. So we have the Assassin's Triangle has two has two equal sides. Now I'm going to do the right triangle. So we have the L and The right triangle has one right angle. Now I'm going to do the obtuse triangle. The obtuse triangle has one obtuse angle. Now I'm going to do the, the acute. The 
acute triangle has all acute angles. Now I'm going to show you how to do different ways with pool table math. So I'm going to do 9 plus what equals 15. Let's, let's get out the 9. Let's get out 9 plus 6 equals 15. Now I'm going to do subtraction. What minus 4 equals 8? 12 minus 4 equals 8. So 12 minus 4 equals 8. Now I'm going to do multiplication. 3 times what equals 15? So let's get out the 3. 3 times 5 equals 15. So let's get out the 5 and then the 15. 3, three times 5 equals 15. Now I'm going to do division. What divided by 16 equals 8? So it is 2 divided by 16 equals 8. So let's get out the 2. divided by 16 2, two divided by 16 equals 8. Thank you. Since I taught you the math and geometry, now I'm going to talk to you about the game. So, low balls are solid colored ball colored balls. They range from 1 to 7. High balls are striped and range from 9 to 15. The white ball is the cue ball. It is the ball that you hit to direct the other balls in the pockets. The object of the game. Get all balls in, in, the, po in the pocket. And, and then, once you got all of them in the pocket... You have to you have to do the eight ball last. This is my math fair project pool table math. The purpose. The purpose of my math project is to understand that you could play pool with geometry and math. My hypothesis. I think that playing pool can help people learn to play pool with geometry and math. My procedure. Angles, lines, and triangles. This is an angle. Me trying to hit the red ball in the hole. And this is us cutting up the, the rack to have two triangles. And this is a circle. And this is a diamond. And this, the ball is a spear. And the triangle is a rack. These are different angles. Me hitting the red ball in the hole. And this is me hitting the red ball in the hole again. And this is me having an angle to, s to hit the balls. These are different angles and lines and triangles. This is a shape. It is a square in the outside. It has a line in the inside and it is a star. And it also has triangles. The black circles are the holes. I could hit it diagonally, and I could hit it straight. Relationship to math. I learned that playing pool has angles, triangles, 
and lines. Conclusion My hypothesis was correct. I learned that math and geometry can, can help people learn how to play pool tables.